Antarctica is the coldest continent on Earth. And it's quite mysterious. We didn't know it had active volcanoes buried underneath it. Tài nghe Bluetooth Air Plus, chuẩn Bluetooth 5.0 mới nhất hiện nay, khoảng cách kết nối tối đa lên đến 15 mét. Thiết kế sang trọng cao cấp, âm thanh được tích hợp công nghệ chống ồn, cửa tạp âm, sử dụng liên tục lên đến 5 tiếng, đảm bảo giải trí cả ngày. Và đặc biệt giá đang cực sốc, chỉ 179 ca ship toàn quốc. Đặt hàng gọi ngay cho shop 0387458303. Until 2013, when scientists accidentally detected two clusters of small earthquakes. Now that we've scanned Antarctica with ice-penetrating radar, we know that there are many more volcanoes hiding below the ice. 138, to be precise. They're buried under layers of ice that are more than four kilometers thick in places. We wouldn't be dealing with volcanic gases making their way to the surface at least as far as one eruption goes. The heat released would melt massive caverns in the ice, creating substantial amounts of meltwater. And that's when things would start getting ugly. The newly created meltwater would cause the ice above it to move more rapidly. The Antarctic ice cover would begin heading into the ocean. From there, the domino effect would kick in. The huge weight of the ice puts all that pressure on volcanoes, keeping them stable. But decrease that pressure, and a volcano gets limbered up, and magma finds a way out through an eruption. In the case of Antarctica, multiple volcanic eruptions could wake up over a hundred other volcanoes and destabilize the entire region. As the volcanoes continued to blow their tops, more meltwater would be created, causing more of the Antarctic ice to slide into the ocean. Antarctic ice would be enclosed by warmer ocean currents. And if all of Antarctica's ice melted, it would raise the global sea level by about 60 meters. Rising sea levels could contribute to major storms moving slower and dropping more rain. Hurricanes and typhoons would wreak havoc on the Earth's surface. Wildlife along coastal areas would lose their habitats, and agricultural soil would become contaminated with salt. Extensive flooding would push millions of people away from the coastline. If the eruptions happened in the span of one day, we'd be looking at thousands of deaths and storms wiping out everything floating in the oceans.